All right, it's that time of the year when uh, the heat is abundant. Uh, people are in the pool. We'll address that today in the law on you from the Virtual Law Center with attorneys Greg Fellerman and Ed Cerimboli. <laughs> nice to have you guys. It's here. great to be here. Really, this is uh, fantastic. Well, and it's a good situation for one of our viewers. They got a pool installed, but uh, Bill and Jenkins Township says, you know what? I've got this pool installed. Uh, should I let the homeowner's insurance in on this? So uh, what do you say to Bill? Absolutely. And the, and the reason being is, is probably not the reason that, that you're thinking. Um, it, you know, the, the reason that you want to have make them aware of it is because if something else happened on your property, and then they found out about it, they could disclaim coverage because you hadn't been honest um, you know, with regard to you know, putting coverages in place on your property. So that's going to increase the value of your home, arguably. Uh, you have an obligation to make sure that your insurance company knows everything about your, your house uh, and why, you know, what they're insuring. They have that, they have that right. So you, make, you want to make sure that you tell them immediately. And from the insurance company's perspective, they're underwriting a certain risk on your property and you know, it's fair to them to know all the risks that are out there. So, and you want to be adequately protected. So the more you let them know, the less arguments they have to write reservations of rights letters, disclaim coverage, all the things you don't want to hear when you have a claim. So when you make changes that could affect coverage, pick up the phone and call. Yeah. They may or may not want it, but at least you asked. Yep. And if someone were to get injured and uh, it wasn't disclosed, that would certainly make things even worse. Oh, oh no question. I mean, you, you know, you run the risk of, of being held personally right. responsible for those injuries if somebody was to get injured, you know, in, at, in and around your swimming pool. All right. Good advice as always. Uh, the number, the website are on your screen. If you need some help and don't forget results matter, attorneys Greg Fellerman and Ed Saramboli from the Virtual Law Center. Yep. Guys, thanks so much. We'll see you next time. Thanks, Thank you. Dave. PAHomepage.com and the Law New Hotline are there for you.